Some changes may be made to the dress code for students in Wake County Public Schools. Board members say the policy may need to be changed because it is inconsistent, inconsistent rather, in the enforcement across high schools. CBS North Carolina's David Hurst has that story. As the weather gets warmer, more revealing clothing becomes more common at high schools. But some students at Athens Drive High say the district-wide dress code is rarely enforced. They enforce it like every now and then. It depends on if it's like really bad stuff. It has some parents calling on the school district to make some changes to the policy. I think it could be a little bit more conservative. Um, you know, shorts down close to the knees, skirts down close to the knees. Um, you know, less tank tops and less revealing things. Before the 2002-2003 school year, the school district changed the dress code and included 11 examples of clothing that was not allowed. Some examples are exposed undergarments, sagging pants, and excessively short or tight garments. The Wake County School Board here says they're considering rewording some of the dress code policy in order to make it easier for high schools to enforce it. I think that's what people will appreciate about us taking longer to delve deeper so that we're creating policies that are easier for everyone to actually implement equally for all students. The board says they plan on looking at the dress code over the course of the next year to see if any changes are needed. In Raleigh, David Hurt, CBS, North Carolina. Staying in Raleigh, police are